Hey, Mickey here. Um, I wanted to shoot a real quick video. I, I just got a phone call. The greatest open. Sorry, I was watching a uh, little Gary V interview. Uh, but I just got a phone. I just got a phone call. And I didn't like it. I didn't like it. Um. And I've dealt with people like that before. You know, you try to give people a chance, work with them, but some people just, they don't and won't get it, and they don't want to get it. But the negativity, the amount of un unself-awareness that people have these days is crazy because, and I'm not talking down because... I was once in the same position. Uh, the amount of un unself awareness is crazy because how can you be so negative and not know it? You know, you, people, we are so negative and we don't know it. You know, it's so easy to be negative. Negative is easy. It's hard to be positive. It's hard to be and stay positive. Why? Everyone around us is negative. And we're negative, you know, so to be positive or to be optimistic is, is is really hard for us to do. And, you know, that's why I wanted to shoot this video, because. And I want to tell you guys how I deal with it. Um, spend less time with that person, talk less with that person. And when that person. Speaks negativity or always wants to call you about some negativity or always wants to mention something negative. Or when you say something, they come back with something negative. Just let it go in one and out the other. I take it, I try to take it so lightly. I try my hardest to take it so lightly. Well, but when people specifically call you, not in a conversation and then boom, they just start being negative. But specifically call you to be negative, like complaining about stuff that you're not going to change. That irritates me. Do not call me and be negative. Do not call me and complain about something that either doesn't matter anyway, it's not even worth being mad about, or isn't going to matter in five years, isn't going to matter tomorrow. Don't call people and be negative, you know, don't, because energy is transferable. You know, energy is transferable and and this is what made me do the video because I know energy is transferable. And this person called me being negative, complaining about something that didn't even matter. It didn't it does it didn't even really matter. And after we got off the phone, it pissed me off. I instantly got angry. Like I sat there and tried to think what was bad about that situation, what was really horrible about that. And I couldn't think of anything. It like it It bothered me. Like, don't don't be negative. Like, don't be negative. If you're thinking about calling somebody and you got something negative to say that doesn't matter, something that you cannot control, something that you just have to wait, complaining about your job or complaining about somebody else doing something this way when they could have did it that way. Like, who cares? You can't change them. All you can change is you. Only worry about what you can change, and I promise you, your life will be better. Stay positive. Deal with positive people. Focus on high-quality relationships. That's what we need to do. You know, we have to deal with negativity. It's real. You can't just be all positive. Anybody try to be all positive, they're, you know, they're tricking themselves. They're, they're lying to themselves. You know, you have to deal with negativity because negative, you know, the negative part of the world is something we have to deal with, you know. That's kind of like when people say, well, why did this have to happen to me? That's just the earth we live on. It's just the planet we live on. Like, things are going to happen to good people. Period. There's nothing you can do about it. There's no, no, nobody on planet earth can explain why things happen. It's just how planet earth works. So don't say, well, I'm a good person. Why did this happen to me? No, it's not that it just happened to you for a reason. Things just happen. But if you let that tear you down, you will you will 
bring in more negativity to you. You will bring on more of those situations to you. So if it doesn't matter, if there's nothing you can do about it, let it go. You know, be positive, stay positive, think positive, keep a, a positive mind frame. Don't let negative people into your brain that way because you will call and you ever, and I'll, I'll say this, you ever dealt with somebody who complained about somebody else or was talking about somebody else? Uh, and then they boom, they come tell you, and it makes you mad. Energy is transferable. Don't spread the negative energy. Spread the positive. When somebody tells you something negative, let it go one ear and out the other, and let it hit the ground. Don't tell nobody else. If you're thinking about doing it, because a lot of us do it, you know, we're we're already we're automatically negative. So a lot of people do it and they don't know it. So for those of us that are, are, you know, have a lot of self-awareness, have gained self-awareness, it's kind of hard to deal with like most people around you because they're not doing it to be mean to you or to because they don't like you. They're doing it because it's automatic. It just comes natural. Negativity comes natural. To talk about something bad comes natural. It comes natural to do that type, those type of things. And so... You have to try to, like I said, take it with a grain of salt. Don't take it super serious. Don't, you know, don't do that because they don't know that they're doing it. And if you try to explain self-awareness to them, they don't want to hear it. So the only thing you can do is when they call you or, you know, they deal with the negative and they call you with the negativity or they you want to speak some something negative. The only thing you can do is let it go one and out the other. Listen. Boom, boom, okay, I feel sorry for you, hope you get better, blah, blah, you know, and then switch the conversation to something positive, so they don't mess up your frequency, hey, or, hey, I gotta call you back, oh, I gotta go check something, you know, to me, that's one of the reasons I feel like, uh, that's one of the uh, places I think a lie can come in handy, you know, I think that's a good lie to me. I think, you know, a lot of people like to think of lying is all bad. No, I mean, if it's lying to help somebody, what's wrong with that? If it's lying to help somebody better themselves, you know, what's wrong with that? If somebody has a natural talent for something, they think they suck, and you tell them, oh, you good. You know, they may not be as good as they can be, but they're good, you know. Oh, I think I suck at it. Well, no, you're, you're, you know, you're actually pretty good. You know, I think you could go somewhere with it. Be positive. Quit, you know, quit being so negative. And the negative people you that you got around you, you might need to close yourself off, close yourself off from them, you know? Close yourself off from them, you know? And you don't have to do the whole delete numbers and, you know, cutting people off. Just deal with them a little less every day until they're gone. You know? Uh, uh, and, you know, that's all I wanted to say. It just... Came up, it crossed my mind. That's all I wanted to say. Uh, I <laughs> I really just, it just, that's something that irritates me. The, 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 the How negative we are and that we don't know it. So I really wish people would just build up their self-awareness, you know. And, yeah, just build up yourself. No, no, like Aristotle says, know thyself, you know. And then the people that are complaining, I know I said the video was over. The people that are complaining... You know, they're worrying about things that they can't control. They're doing the same thing every day, expecting a different result. That is the definition of insanity. So you can write that person off. This, you know, this person is insane. You know, don't say it to them because then they're going to they gonna blow up. They don't have any self-awareness. They're going to think they're crazy. But that's the definition of insanity. Doing the same thing, expecting a different result. You going to work at the same job every day, complaining about the same boss, complaining about the, about the same pay, and you're not doing anything to change it. So that's your fault. That's not their fault. That's your fault. So, that's my spiel. That's my little rant. Stay positive. Spread good vibes. Greet people with a smile, have an attitude of gratitude, and you guys have a good day. No boss life.